What up, what up, what up? Unbreakable Kicks Army. Last night we did go live and we literally went over every place that we could do a raffle for these Air Jordan 1 UNC Blues. Now, look, I honestly feel like this is probably the scariest release right here, man. These Jordan 1 UNC Blues, it's gonna be rough. Now, I did make a post last night on my IG and they said Mocha's had 250,000 pairs released and these only got 130,000. So my question is, why did they cut this shoe by 120,000 pairs? Now I know a lot of y'all was making jokes <laughs> and things of that nature about the whole Nike thing going on, but it's gonna be scarce. This is gonna be a very, very scarce release. So if you did not catch that live last night, make sure you go and check it out. It's gonna be very helpful, very beneficial for all those who are trying to grab a pair of these for retail. Since this is March, March Madness is started, and we're going on a whole UNC vibe. I mean, I wanna make sure that you guys grab your UNC or baby blue, whatever color you like to call this, Soul Premise Travel Bag. This bag right here is TSA approved. You can use promo code UNBREAKABLE or promo code UNBREAKABLE KICKS to get you 35% off all of the bags from the daily bag, the commuter bag, the Luciano leather bag, which holds up to size 15, the sneakers, or the duffel bag. And we got the roller bags now for like people really traveling, traveling. The world is slowly starting to wake up, so your boy will be doing some more shows this year. And I already got a couple of them booked. For instance, if I did want to take the UNC bag with the UNC ones, bow, got them right here, safe and secure. I could throw an outfit up in here if it's like a one day event, get my laptop for editing. I can put like my toothpaste, my deodorant and stuff right here in the front of the bag. Also got another compartment right here that you can put like a charger or things of that nature. If you're going on a trip like one or two days, I say the daily bag or the commuter bag will work. If you're doing like two to three days or even more, the Luciano Leather XL, the duffel bag, or the roller bags will do you just fine. Click the link in the description section below, take you straight to my sole premise page. Again, using my promo code get you 35% off all bags. Most of you guys have clicked on the video because you're seeing that I'm not grabbing those Air Jordan 4 UNCs that's coming out April 28th. Number one, I just could not get over that tongue. Like for instance, when we had the Air Jordan 3 UNCs that dropped last year, they put that part of the tongue inside of the shoe. We had the Air Jordan 5 Green Apple, the Oregon joint, or the Air Jordan 5 Michigan, they put that tab on the back. So it made the shoe look a lot better. Yes, those small little details it does definitely throw off the shoe. Now that's one small reason why I'm not grabbing that shoe. Now don't get me wrong, Army, that joint is still fire. Colorway is fire, and it looks very, very close to the PE. Now, we do get some of the Air Jordan 4s. I've seen a couple legit resellers with that pair out already, and I'm about to just go ahead and check the price on those right here. Jordan 4 University Blues. Highest bid right now on StockX for a size 11 is $750. The lowest ask right now for a 10 and a half is $1,500. The highest bid is 800 bucks. Now, I don't know what's going on. Now, a couple years ago, early shoes was not going for this price. Now, can we blame the pandemic? What can we, like, seriously, I didn't even expect to go on this little short tangent. But to see the resale price of a shoe that's a month away being at 800 bucks now, don't get me wrong, that price will definitely go down, you know, a little bit by the time the shoe actually released. A 12 lowest ask is $7,300. Now, of course, nobody's gonna pay that, I hope, but it's just, it's changing again. Sneaker industry is changing again. I hate to call it the sneaker game because number one, I don't look at this like a game, okay? And if you look at it like it's a game, in a game you got winners and losers. So a lot of people be on the losing end and if I'm losing every Saturday, I don't wanna play this game no more. So I don't call it the sneaker game, I call it the sneaker industry. Or if I have been calling it the sneaker game, I will no longer try to refer to it as the sneaker game. But again, these joints are going $700, $800 a month early. Now, it's not 
that abnormal, but these asking prices are just out the wazoo. Again, it is a fire Air Jordan 4, but I personally like the Air Jordan 1s better. Also, Army, I made this perfectly clear. I said, if I get a specific shoe before these were to come out, I'm not touching them. And I meant that wholeheartedly. So, let's go ahead and open up this box right quick. So in hand, I got an Air Jordan 4 box right here. Label reads, Air Jordan 4 Retro. Colorway is Valor Blue, College Navy White, size 11. All right? Sample tag right here. Flip the lid. This is the sole reason while I will not be purchasing the Air Jordan 4 University Blues next month. I mentioned to y'all a while ago, like I love how Jordan brand, believe it or not, even with the Air Jordan 6 electric lime, we seen official images of those, they look just like the Air Jordan 6 organ, but they don't have the wings on the back and a couple other features that they may or may not have. I'm cool with it, but I would prefer to have that college PE over the general release just because the general releases are always just a tad bit different. Now, the prices of them joints going right now, they almost in some PE price ranges. At $1,700, you can get some PEs for $1,700. It may not be like a collegiate PE, but you can catch a couple like friends and family, you know, like the PSG 5s or a PSNY 10 or some of that nature for like $1,700. But these joints right here are just beautiful. Now, they are similar. They are similar to the joints that we will be getting next month. But these joints right here are just crazy. Now, this is the first time that I've seen these in hand. Well, actually own these and looking at these compared to the general release, it's a lot of differences between the two. Mainly, they're using a lot more cement print on the wings. They're using cement print down here on the midsole and the outsole is black. So, different than the Air Jordan 4 University Blues that we will be getting. Well, Army, I'm gonna jump on the turntable and give you guys an up close personal look at these Air Jordan 4 UNC PEs. Then we can jump back in front of the camera to end the video off. All right, Army, got the box on the turntable. Standard Air Jordan 4 box, nothing special. Label on the joint read, Air Jordan 4 Retro. Colorway is Valor Blue, College Navy White, size 11. Shout out to my brothers over there at English Soul for this pickup. Nothing special inside, just your trash bag paper right here. Now checking these out on the turntable again. So glad I got these. Now I wanna say these were worn one time. Was a one time where, and it's just crazy with like PEs. PEs, if you wear a shoe one time, the price go down by like 500 bucks. So your boy does plan on rocking these. I got a lot of UNC merch coming in, so it didn't really hurt to go ahead and grab a one-time worn sneaker. I love the see-through outsole because it kind of reminds me of those Air Jordan 4 lasers back in the day. I want to say for like the 25th anniversary or something like that, we had those laser 4s with that clear outsole. You got your UNC blue paint on the midsole and you got that speckle of the obsidian blue. So you don't really have that cement gray like we got on the general release pair that we'll be getting is mainly just UNC blue and then you got that speckle of that obsidian. I love these wings up here. Mm, wings. <laughs> a lot of wings up here. Kind of got like a see-through hit to it as well. They got some fire PE. Like the coldest ones to me, honestly, may be the Jordan 4s. You got the Oklahomas. You got the Florida Gators. You got the UNCs, the Marquettes, the Michigans, and the Georgetown. As of right now, I only have the UNC's and I got the Michigan pair up there as well. So the hardest pair of the four to grab right now is the Marquette. I want to say they only oh, man maybe less than fifty pair of the Marquette fours. So those have definitely climbed up there in price. I should have got them when they was a little bit cheaper, but those joints would definitely be copped before the year is out. As of right now, Michigan is pretty much complete. They did just drop those new Michigan fives. They got the UNC 5s, the Oklahoma 5s. 
So I'm just trying to catch up. One thing for any of anybody who's trying to get into samples and PEs, especially the collegiate joints, you got to grab them when you can because as time go on, they push out more shoes and then these joints start to dry up. So you got an all blue insole, obsidian jump man. You do got a spare pair of white laces. They did come with a spare pair of white laces as well army so y'all let me know how y'all feel about these tongue you got that unc branding on the tongue says north carolina flight right there on the tongue this is a combination of like the booty backstroke suede and a combination of like that thicker suede so it is good to have the threes and the fours i got a lot of work to do for the unc collection but i'm slowly but surely gonna get it rocking so the threes went to the football team the fours went to the basketball so team go ahead and get these joints one more quick 360 then we can jump back in front of the camera to end the video off you guys have seen the Air Jordan 4 UNC PEs. How do you feel about them? These joints are nice. I love them. I'm glad that I actually picked them up. Now it's time for me to go ahead and get the rest of the UNC collection. UNC collection right now is hot and I feel like I might as well go ahead and grab them before the price starts to go up even more on them. Now normally when we get a GR version of a PE it makes the PE version go down. But seeing so many differences between these and the GR version, I feel like these are still going to be hot in pricing. So Army, let me know in the comment section below if you guys would prefer the GR version or if you guys prefer the PE version. Let me know how y'all feel about these joints in the comment section below. And other than that, you got your boy Unbreakable. You got the Air Jordan 4 UNC PE. You got the Unbreakable Vault. Unbreakable Army stands strong like always. Hug your loved ones. And we out.